Oh, hey, welcome to my closet. To my channel I am kid free this weekend so I am trying to go around and find some pieces to finish my capsule wardrobe if you guys have been watching me uh, on Instagram you know I've started the process uh, in creating a capsule wardrobe because number one I feel like I buy clothes but my style has evolved like I'm in my 30s now and I just feel like I want to look more polished the high-waisted jeans and the crop tops were kind of like my style in my 20s but I just want to look a lot more polished and a lot more not professional but put together so I can still do high-waisted jeans but I want them to be like mom jeans loose fitting if I wear a crop top and then put like a, a button-down shirt over it and uh, a couple of accessories to kind of bring it all together so I decided that my capsule wardrobe theme, the colors are going to be black and white as well as nudes. I love nudes, so like a cream color, like a, a soft pink as well as a pop of green, like a soft green to kind of bring it all together and a soft chocolate brown. And I decided to do a capsule wardrobe because number one, it takes the stress out of trying to find an outfit the main idea is to get core pieces that you can mix and match so you're kind of like saving money over the long term as well but you want to make sure that you get quality pieces so not like the fashion nova or sheen sheen however you say it which were my go-to's but i find that all of the pieces that I spent a little bit more money for up front they last me so much longer and they're just higher quality so i'm trying to be strategic now with how i'm buying clothes um as well as looking for name brands that i know are going to last me a long time even though the price may be more upfront. it just saves you more money over the long term because you're not having to constantly replace those items um i'm excited i'm excited to no longer go in my closet and feel like I don't have anything to wear because I wasn't strategic when I was buying certain clothes. I was just buying them because they looked cute. I was not buying them thinking, oh, I can, you know, mix and match these and pair it up with this or pair it up with that. So I think when it's all laid out, it's just going to make a lot more sense to me and I'm going to feel a lot better about like my style. I'm still very basic, but I still want to look put together because it just makes you feel better so I'm hoping that I find some pieces in Plato's closet I'm just looking for a few more shirts like I like the white collared shirts that you can pair with like a tank underneath or um, like a blazer so that is what I am trying to go in and find just a couple more of those and a couple more of these and I should be good to go but Let's go ahead and go shopping. I've been needing black jeans, so I got black jeans to try on two pairs. I'm trying to stick with American Eagle. This one's 16. This is a cute shirt that I'm gonna open up. 
This one's tin. Yeah, and then this, I don't know if I'm gonna like this or if this is even gonna fit, but this is from Banana Republic. Um, 12. Okay, guys, so I just got out and I will say like I went to Goodwill before here and they didn't have much of anything either. I'm trying to find the white collared shirt that I can tuck into high waisted pants and Plato's Closet didn't have it. Goodwill didn't have it. And I used to see an abundance of those shirts whenever I was not looking for them. Um, so I'm going to go run and grab something to eat. And then I'm going to check out one more Goodwill and pray that they have some more button down shirts like this, as well as a white collared shirt. Um, but all in all, I am happy. Whoa, my fingers in the way. Uh, I am happy that I got a pair of black pants because that was the last pair of bottoms that I was needing as well as like another button down shirt like this and I spent a total of $28.47 on those two items um so not bad my total overall budget is $40 so I'm really really hoping that the next Google I go to will have the items that I need so that I can be done with this capsule wardrobe for right now. I am eventually going to get um, some shoes, but I have to wait on that because I'm, I'm running out of money. I'm on a very strict budget, um, but I can make the shoes that I have right now just work. I'm just trying to get like all of my core pieces done and out of the way before winter comes. And uh, the pieces that I have, I'm gonna use them for all seasons i'm trying to buy things that i can use for every season like a tank obviously i can wear this in the spring and the summer um just have to throw one of these over and um we're good to go but i'm gonna go eat and then let's check out one more place if you don't eat in your car are you even normal like i just ordered some alfredo i'm not gonna lie for the amount of money i spent i spent ten dollars and some change it was cold so that kind of pissed me off especially since she just rang it up when i got in there but anyway i ate that because i was starving and it is a gorgeous day out i feel like we have not seen the sun in days it's been rainy and it has been cloudy and i'm someone like the weather truly affects me so I was taking naps left and right, but um, for my Alfredo, I try not to eat it all. I'm leaving the rest for dinner so that I don't have to go back out and purchase anything and I don't have to go out and I still haven't gone grocery shopping y'all to find something to cook. So this $10 is going to stretch over lunch and dinner. So really $5 five and five five for lunch and five for dinner but i am getting tired so i am going to head out to the other goodwill before i change my mind all right hopefully you guys can see but this is my capsule wardrobe all of this there's some extra back here don't mind that so like i was saying in the beginning my colors are pretty much going to be black and white so i have black and white here i have some nudes so you'll see a lot of nudes here in the center and then going to my jeans i have the black pair of jeans that I found at that thrift store, some black leggings, and my mom jeans that I'm obsessed with. So I kind of got a little color coordination going on. 
Uh, but first up here, obviously I'm not going to wear this come the summer. So this is more so fall and winter. I just have a black um sweater that i found i got this at walmart y'all so i got this at walmart i got this at nudie patootie it was pricey i tried to find some at the thrift store everyone they must be in style because normally they would have some they didn't have any this was the jacket jean jacket that I, I'm, I'm gonna use it as a jacket okay but um wow I was looking at the screen finder the whole time. Please forgive me. This is the blue jean jacket that I found at that thrift store. So shirts like this, I'm just going to wear it under here. Hopefully you guys can see, but I'm just going to wear it like this underneath here. And then for my shirts, I still have not found the white button down shirt that I want. But I do have this white turtleneck that I never wore. I'm not quite sure where I got it. It might have been Fashion Nova, but luckily I found it. So I'm gonna make this part of my wardrobe until I can find a white button down. Right now they're running about $40 and I don't want to spend $40. So we're just gonna have to make it do what it do with this. Um, going into shirts, this is typically my style. So the crop top styles, this is from Naked Wardrobe. And so the legging set and this go together. Naked Wardrobe is a little pricey, but guys, I promise you, I have a dress from them. I've had it for as long as my daughter has been alive, which is nine years. So they have pieces that are made to be mixed and matched and they're really thick quality. So this these are not regular leggings they're thick quality leggings you can tell like when you grab them um but i can either wear this together or wear them apart then so far i just have like some nude this nude sweater tank this is going is like a nude crop top too i can wear in summer spring and fall so right now and if it doesn't get too hot this year i might still wear it for the winter time and then this is what i had on at the beginning of the video just a black top that i can pair with some high-waisted jeans and like a button down over it i only have one dress right now that i wanted to keep and this is a nude dress. This came from, what do you know, Fashion Nova. But it is good quality. Um, we all know like with Fashion Nova, it might be a hit or miss. You might have your whole butt cheek showing in their clothes. But this one was really good. It's really thick. It's like a, a thick cotton material. So I'm keeping this. Um... I also found these pair of pants. I wear them from time to time. They're sheen. And I like that it goes with the, um, the nude theme that I have going on. As well as these pants. These pants are, they're really loose and flowy. They have a slit going up and down each side. And I think they'll be really cute because they're high-waisted. And it can pair with one of my crop tops so I want loose flowing jeans if I do wear a crop top and then the mom jeans I promise you the mom jeans from American Eagle are like a godsend I love them especially the high-waisted ones so like you know you can tuck some things in and it works out pretty well and really quickly as far as shoes I have a lot of shoes in here but I don't wear half of these shoes I went a little crazy at Walmart whenever they had a sale on like the baby doll shoes what do they call them these types of shoes Wow I got these types of shoes in almost every color that's when I was working in the office and I needed new shoes because I only had one or two pair at the time I went a little crazy and didn't realize that they ran big so I have to stuff socks in them to keep them from falling off my feet 
I am going to wind up selling these because I never really wore any of them because they were too big. But once I sell them and see how much money I have to work with from what I've sold, then I am going to turn around and buy some more shoes. Like I want like the loafer slip-ons, but they're a little pricey. So I, I'm not really worried about shoes. I have enough to last me throughout the winter time. And then whenever I feel like I have enough money in my clothes sinking fund, I will go back out and purchase some more shoes. But in the meantime, hit the thumbs up button. Leave down below if you want to try a capsule wardrobe. And if you have a capsule wardrobe, leave some tips down below because I still need all of the tips. And I will catch you in the next one.